find the radius of curvature for the curve r equal to a cos theta. Now radius of curvature at any point r comma theta is given by formula for that curve. We are given a curve in polar coordinate form. So observe that we just need to compute dr by theta and d2r by d theta square. Since r equal to a cos theta, we differentiate both sides with respect to theta to obtain dr by d theta derivative of, of a cos theta. Derivative cos theta is minus sin theta. So that's equal to minus a sin theta. 2r by d theta square. We differentiate once again derivative sin theta is cos theta. Rho denote rho radius of curvature equal to r square. r is a cos theta. So a cos theta whole thing square plus dr by d theta whole thing square minus a sin theta whole thing square to the power 3 by 2 divided by r square r is a cos theta whole thing square so that can be written as a square cos square theta plus 2 times dr by d theta whole thing square minus minus is plus so a square sin square theta r is a cos theta and then double derivative minus a cos theta take a square common square and root will get cancelled and you are left out with a cube cos square plus sin square is 1 so 1 only in denominator we can take a square common cos square theta plus 2 sin square theta minus minus plus so cos square theta again sin square plus cos square is 1 and 1 plus 1 is 2 so this is just 2 so this is equal to a by 2 oh radius of curvature is constant can you guess that curve that curve must have been a circle so we have computed radius of curvature equal to constant and we guess that it's that the curve must have been a circle is that true let's see r equal to a cos theta let's multiply both side by r so r square equal to 8 into r cos theta now we switch from polar to Cartesian then x equal to r cos theta y equal to r sin theta and then x square plus y square equal to r square so r square can be simply written as x square plus y square and r cos theta can be written as x So that gives us x square minus ax plus y square equal to 0. We take ax to the left hand side. x square minus ax plus y square equal to 0. Let's complete the square. a by 2 square. We add a by 2 square to the left hand side as well as right hand side. So this is equal to x minus a by 2 whole thing square plus y square equal to is a by 2 whole thing square. Yes, this is equation of circle with center a by 2 comma 0 and radius equal to a by 2. Yes, radius of curvature is same as radius of the circle in this case.